Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around August 2nd. You know, the full moon's a third, so this energy is definitely fluid. Um, any of the readings that I've done in the last few days, you know, could play out at any time, so keep that in mind. Um, let's just get started. Let's get started. What do we have? What do we have for a message today? The sun and the king of cups. So this is all about love. Okay, it is all about love. Um, happiness, extreme happiness. Uh, expressing emotion. Okay, so this is it's very, uh, it's a very loving time. So we do have, this is definitely about expressing love, showing love, having fun. Um... It looks like somebody has been watching and they're they're they've been holding out but they're about to express. You know as you see the telescope there. You know, so it's like they've been watching, now they've it looks like they're about to express something. Now this does have to do with a new day, a new beginning, okay? Cuz the sun is a new beginning. It's a new day. Um it's a breakthrough of some sort. Coming in twos, which are interesting. That one, those two came in two, and these two came in twos. We got two upright, two reversed. <laughs> so this is uh, Four of Swords reversed and the Wheel of Fortune reversed. This is a setback. But this is very emotional. You may have an individual that has had some sort of setback with the Wheel of Fortune reversed. The Four of Swords, it could be sick. This is illness of some sort. It is. This is unfortunate, and it could be an unfortunate illness. This is seeing the light. This is this is like rejoicing. But this wheel of fortune reverse is is, is bad luck. It is. I can't say that it's not. It is bad luck. Wrong place at the wrong time or something uh, not working out this 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 is a this could be a you know the wheel of fortune reversed is is uh an unpredictable loss it is an unpredictable loss with the four of swords right next to it i mean the four of swords and when i get a card in reversed it's not good not always i mean sometimes it's better in reverse but in this case it's not Okay, this is extremely sick, extremely ill. Knight of Cups. Now, the Knight of Cups is looking for a relationship, looking for love, following their heart. So somebody is going to be following their heart. This is somebody that is coming in or they're moving very quickly. Uh, it looks like this person is moving very fast, very optimistic as well, very optimistic about love. This is emotional support or a, a loving message that is coming. Somebody is going to be offering some, or, or speaking. They're going to be saying something. They're going to be expressing. That's what it is. It's expressing love. They may have taken a break. Maybe they were sick. Maybe they were ill. Maybe they uh, were in some sort of unfortunate situation in the past or which hindered them from coming forward. Something's going on here. But this Knight of Cups is is an offer of love or emotional support or somebody expressing themselves. Now, this is, this is also... Um, compassion ten of swords next to the wheel of fortune reversed well, let's get another card queen of cups reversed so this is probably going to be an emotional time okay there may be a celebration that is coming up just have to tell you because that sun card looks like there's some sort of celebration 
So there may be a celebration coming up. And, it, and you know, this is the sun is about life. So I don't know if it's a celebration of life. Now, this could even be a birth. Okay, it could be a birth, but it could also be the opposite. Sorry. Anyhow, there's going to be news, and it's going to be unexpected news because this is unexpected. It is unpredictable, and this is news, so there's going to be some unexpected news. It may be not what you think it is, just saying. We have this Ten of Swords. This is uh, somebody that has been stabbed in the back and they've been hurt. They are probably uh, very weak. They are probably, uh, you know, they could be bleeding. Somebody's getting away. So I don't know what this is. I don't know if it's a hit and run or, or what it is. But And this is a horrendous... Uh, loss. It's an unfortunate loss. Could be an accident. I don't know what is going on, but this this is somebody getting away. It's like they've committed something. Maybe it's they've committed a crime or something, and they're they're sneaking away. Okay, they're they're out of here. Okay, they're out of here. So be prepared for something like that. But this is help. I believe that that help will arrive. Okay, or some sort of emotional support. This Queen of Cups reversed is, uh, I think it's going to be very intense. It's going to be very, 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 very intense. You notice that that sun is very bright. It's hot. That's intense. It's intense. It is. It is. When you have all these cups, cups are um, emotions, and emotions can be in intense. Um, anyway. Um, now the Queen of Cups in reversed is deep sadness. It, it it really is. It's heartbreak. So I'm not sure what is in its heartbreak right next to the Ten of Swords. So I don't know if there's going to be. You know, this person looks like they're alive. So I don't know. I don't know. But you know, it looks like they they this person thinks that they have gotten away with it, but they might not. They might not. Now this could be somebody coming in. Uh, you know, this is support, some sort of support. Anyhow, um, now this is the King of Cups is somebody that is very caring, has really good in, in, in the upright. This person is caring, they have good intentions, very feeling, um, has a really big heart. So this person has a really big heart. Now, the, this is an unfortunate loss. Somebody may be feeling some sort of pain. You know, they may be feeling some sort of pain over a loss of a person that has a really big heart. And it could be a male or a female. And it just, it is what it is. Okay. But the sun is extreme happiness. This is freedom. This is a blessing. This is being in great health. It is healing. It is a life-giving energy. It's a new day. It's a new beginning, okay? So we do have a new beginning here, but it comes after some sort of deep sadness and heartbreak. You know, after being betrayed, after being stabbed in the back, after being left for dead. You know, this person's left for, for dead. This is somebody coming in that is very, very uh, loving, put it that way. Somebody is coming in that is very loving. And they could help to heal because this is helping to heal. So somebody could be coming in to help to heal. And this is healing as well. This is like a healing light. It's a healing energy. So, interesting. Death. Oh, boy. So there definitely could be a death. And I know people don't want to hear that. And they want to say, oh, it's just the death of the old you. Well, death is real. Okay, death is real. And death in reverse could be, you know, it could be an actual death. Death or it could be a near death experience. Death is an accident or an incident, um, a disaster. Um, somebody can't hold on anymore. Maybe they've been ill. They've been sick with this Four of Swords. They've been on their deathbed. Okay, I'm just going to show it to you. I know a lot of people don't want to hear this, but it is what it is. So somebody's been on their deathbed or they've been near death. And, you know, 
and it wasn't the right time. You know, this is bad timing. This is a horrendous loss. You know, maybe, maybe, uh, you know, this death card reversed is, is, uh, it's either a near death experience or it's an actual death of a situation. It could be the end of stagnation as well for some of you. If you, this is somebody that's looking for a love, looking for a lit relationship, okay? Now, this has been a stagnant period. This could be, you know, you've held on long enough. Here comes a new relationship for some of you. This is an offer of love. Somebody's, and whether it is from heaven or it is from another person, it is an offer of love. So some, and it is a blessing and it is a healing light. It is a healing love. It is a definitely a healing love. So there's, there's, there's something coming in. It's unpredictable that uh, will give you the opportunity to heal, okay? Um, this death card reverse, this holding on is getting old, giving up. Giving up this old life. Giving up. Ace of Cups. Now, the Ace of Cups is uh, outpouring of emotion. I think it is going to be very emotional. I do. I think there's going to be tears because of this. Because of all these cups, period. There's going to be some tears. I think emotions are going to be running high. I feel like um, there's a new start in love. There is a new start in love. Okay, there is. But it comes after uh, a serious uh, betrayal. Okay, this is the serious betrayal, a near-death experience, or, or a death. Death is an ending. Okay, death is an ending, and, and we definitely do have it here. Okay, death, death, death. Okay, so we definitely have death here. It's the death of the old. Okay, and this is the new. This is the new. So this is a new life. It is a new life. It is a new beginning that will be very uh, full of love, okay? There will be an abundance of love. It will be bright. It will bring happiness. This is extreme bliss. This is a whole lot of love, okay? It is. So somebody, you know, this, this Ace of Cups is... It's overflowing. It's overflowing with love. There's, there's so much love there that it can't even be contained, okay? Um... And this person appears to be um, full of it. You see, you see the two doves. This is this is a union. This is definitely a union. There is a union here. Somebody is going to be following their heart. They're going to be following their heart and they're going to be expressing their feelings. I know that's what's going to happen. And I think that they have been in a place of stagnation. Maybe they weren't healed from some sort of previous unfortunate loss or something like that. They, they stayed down and, and they stayed there for a while. But now they're getting up. It feels like now they're getting up. And they're going someplace else. It's like they're going for help. Because this is help. It's like they're getting help or there's help arriving. Justice reversed. Justice reversed. This is unfair. We talked about this yesterday. This is unfair. This is a lack of balance right next to the death card reversed. There is some there could be an unfortunate accident, and I'm not sure what this is, but uh, now, or an incident. There's an unfortunate accident or an incident that makes somebody feel like this isn't fair. This really isn't fair. You didn't see it coming because the Wheel of Fortune is reversed. <sighs> it's against the law. You see, the law is reversed. It's against somebody may be doing something against the law, um, and it could it could end in, you know. The worst could happen, put it that way. But the Ace of Cups is 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 a, is, a, is a card of heaven. It really is, and so isn't the Sun. So I'm not sure what is going on here. This is a blessing. There is some sort of blessing. 
it's a blessing that something ends, even though it, it may seem that it is not fair. Um, this justice reversed. This is unfair. This is not. This is not true. It's not true. I can't believe this is true. It's there's lack of there's lack of truth. There's somebody's not telling the truth, or they didn't tell the truth. Lack of integrity. Somebody may have gotten away with something, and this is bad karma. Okay, this is bad karma, and this is bad luck, and this is bad karma as well. So there is definitely some bad karma here. Okay, there's some bad karma here. Somebody's getting some bad karma, and I don't, I don't know in what form. Um, they could be losing somebody that they love, and I hate to say that, but this is losing. The wheel of fortune reverse is losing, and this is this is love. I don't know what is going on. So, uh, and that it doesn't mean that person is gonna die. It mean it. I mean it means that, that that person may be leaving. You see, this person is escaping. You know, they may they may just be leaving. They may just you know that could and karma can go back to past lives. Somebody's leaving. Okay, somebody's leaving. Period. They are leaving, and they're headed towards love and they may be headed towards a new love this is a new day a new beginning somebody may be leaving and they're headed towards a new love you know they're just they're just doing it you know they're just they've just decided that they're gonna do it and they don't care if about the outcome they don't care if it hurts you they don't care they're doing it anyway they're following their heart somebody is following their heart towards love and they don't care who they hurt in the process called self-love and this is self-love the ace of cups is self-love it is but whoever it is that they hurt is going to be very 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 sad there's sadness here there's heartbreak but this heartbreak leads to a new beginning because this is a new beginning so I mean I there is a new love here there is definitely a new love here. There's a new opportunity for love with somebody that uh, is looking for a relationship. This person is looking for a relationship. They've been in a situation that uh, set them back or they, they were in a situation that wasn't honest, that wasn't truthful, that drained them or whatever they were in a situation that maybe they, they were some sort of betrayal and now there's like a healing love this is a healing love it's a healing light okay um it's definitely going to be emotional This is the 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 uh justice reversed is no resolution something not turning out the way that you had hoped so there's there's bad luck bad karma there's there's there could be some legal issues or some some sort of some situation that you thought was going to go your way it doesn't go your way it didn't work out or it doesn't work out something doesn't work out with the wheel of fortune reversed and the justice reversed and it's actually a blessing it's actually a blessing because whoever you were dealing with was was very secretive they were secretive they were sneaky they may have had somebody else this death card reversed is is uh a disaster of some sort or destruction somebody's been held back by fear they've been wanting to end it they've been wanting it to end they have they've been wanting it to end but they couldn't act with integrity or they couldn't tell the truth they couldn't tell the truth but the Knight of Cups expresses their feelings. It's over. Something is, is definitely over with the Four of Swords reverse and the Death reverse. It's done. It's over. 
and I think it's been almost over for a long time. There's lethargy here as well with both these cards. There's there's like things getting worse and worse and worse and worse. And there's no resolution in sight. The only way to resolve this is to leave. Goodbye. That's what this is. Goodbye. It really is. I'm headed towards love. And it's, it's not about you anymore. It's about me. So somebody is making the choice to leave because out of self-love. And they are going to be expressing their feelings probably to both people. I think that they're going to be expressing their feelings to whoever it is that they're hurting. And they're going to be expressing their feelings to the one that they love or the one that they are interested in. There's a new love interest here. And the sun card is about freedom. So that is breaking free. Enlightenment. It's about being happy. I just want to be happy. It's about going after happiness. So I do believe that we have an individual here that is about to break free from a dark situation that they have been holding on to. I feel like there's going to be a lot of emotions. I think there's going to be a lot of tears. Like tomorrow. I don't know if it's tomorrow. Yeah. Or the third. Whatever it is. Um, and there's going to be a lot of tears. I think, I think that somebody is giving up holding on they can't hold on anymore they've uh, tried to prolong it but their the heart wants what the heart wants that's what I see the heart the heart wants what the heart wants and it feels like their past mistakes with that wheel of fortune reverse keep coming back somebody's past mistakes keep coming back to haunt them and they will keep continuing to come back round things will keep coming back to haunt them until they act with integrity they will keep getting bad luck and bad karma until they follow their heart that's the way it goes and if you're not following your heart you're staying in a situation for all the wrong reasons you will have setback after setback after setback after setback so anyway I feel as though uh, we have with this these are both giving up it's like giving up it's like giving up no more holding on it's over it is over it is and it's gonna hurt it's going to hurt the person that is being left and the person that is leaving is is running towards new love running So anyhow, I think there's 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 definitely going to be this is sadness. It is. And it it is. So there's going to be some sort of sadness. But this sadness leads to a new beginning and it's it is hard to believe that that's how it goes, but that is how it goes. This ending is actually a blessing because this is big love. But somebody has been stuck with the Wheel of Fortune reversed. They've been stuck. They've been clinging to control. They've been not allowing change. They've been not completing that last chapter of their lives. They've been holding on to something that was dead. But now it feels as though, you know, they're following their heart. This is definitely looking for love. Looking for love, following their heart. This is a new beginning. Somebody's going to be expressing their feelings. And, and on one hand, it's going to hurt. And on the other hand, it brings happiness.
somebody has been dishonest with themselves about a relationship. And they may have lost something good while they were waiting. They were waiting. Anyhow, I think that you can expect a new start coming soon with this Ace of Cups. I think that there is gonna that we're gonna have a very emotional time here. There's gonna be a lot of uh, emotions spilling out. Okay, tears. Be prepared to shed some tears. There's a loss here as well. Somebody's gonna experiencing experience a loss, and it's a it's some sort of it could be you know. You take it however it is, but it, it's, this isn't fair. I can't believe that's how it turned out. How could this happen? But this loss, it feels like this loss leads to uh, a new relationship, which is interesting. Good luck.